The next section provides information on the following topics. Sleep, hydration, workout nutrition, alcohol, tobacco, energy drinks, marijuana, prescription drugs, and performance enhancing drugs. I learned right away, yeah, you gotta get your rest. It was huge. And we play a lot more games during the spring. And um, it, was, it was a busy schedule. We play all the time. So that was my first year of really playing all the time. So I learned quickly, you know, I had, you had to take care of yourself. Athletes need sleep to maximize their performance in school, athletics, and life. But especially when it comes to improving athletic performance. It is recommended that athletes sleep 8 to 10 hours a night to properly recover. Yeah, I see her clear in my iPad at night because they've said, there's been some studies now saying if you're on your iPad or your computer at night, it, can, it might make it more difficult to fall asleep. Did you know? It is recommended to stay off your electronics one to two hours prior to going to sleep to allow your brain to rest properly. Playing video games and using alcohol and other drugs will reduce your sleep cycle, which will reduce the body's ability to recover. Plus, not getting the proper amount of sleep will affect your pre-movement, movement, and balance. You know, two or three hours a day of physical training, uh, that, that, that's not a picnic. And, uh, you know, if you want to have the readiness to train so that you gain the training effect and, and improve, uh, you have to be rested. Did you know, if your sleep cycle is interrupted for two days, this can lead to three times the increase in lapse of attention and reactivity. In terms of staying hydrated, uh, I'm, I always have a cup of water in my hand or I'm carrying a water bottle, uh, making sure that I'm uh, staying hydrated at all times because that's how your body functions. You know, that's how you feel fresh, that's how you feel energized. So uh, always making sure I have water with me at all times as well. Hydration is a critical factor in athletic performance. It is recommended that you consume at least 10 ounces of watered down sports drinks throughout your competition because dehydration will not only decrease muscular strength and endurance, but will also decrease blood flow to muscle and tissues, as well as impair your ability to properly regulate your body temperature. You know, hydration is important. Water is the best thing that you can put in your body. Um, and you know, it's just continuing to take care of what you have created. You know, your body is your masterpiece. Did you know, for every 2% you dehydrate, you lose 10% in performance across all physiological systems. And remember, weight loss through dehydration is strongly discouraged because it can cause rapid dehydration and heat stroke, which may be fatal. I've learned a lot with, uh, as myself as a player, uh, just to keep my body going with stretching and, and weight training and eating right and staying hydrated. There's especially being an everyday player in the minor leagues. So you play 144 games, you play every day, so you have to really stay on top of it. The life of an athlete program focuses on how to best fuel your body for optimal performance. It's important for student athletes to understand the best food that will enhance your workout. Athletes should eat a carbohydrate rich snack with a small amount of liquid protein two to four hours prior to exercise. So it's kind of taking responsibility, it's being ready and having time management because it is difficult, especially when you're in high school, when you have class, you get up early, you're not quite ready for breakfast, so you go straight to school. You know, pack a little lunch, pack a little snack and be ready for your day. You know, nutrition is important because you're fueling your body and your body is what gets you through the day, it's what gets you through a game. Some good foods to keep blood sugar levels up during competition that contain fast-acting, simple carbohydrate meals are raisins, apples, and fig bars. After competition, it is recommended that athletes eat a meal that contains one-half fruits and veggies, one-quarter carbohydrates, one-quarter protein. I spent probably three, four, five hours in the gym during the summertime while other people might be doing other things because you know, I knew if they weren't in the gym and I was, I was staying out of trouble, I was putting in hard work, it would pay off for me, and, and I was lucky enough that it did. Did you know, athletes that train or exercise from 7 to 11 in the morning will lead to more muscle gain compared to any other time of day. Remember, during competitions, matches, and training, it is better to sip your sports drink. Don't gulp.